Welcome to World's Best Videos. We've compiled a list of facts about cult leader and murderer Charles Manson. Let's get into it. Charles Manson is an American cult leader. His followers carried out several notorious murders in the late 1960s and inspired the book Helter Skelter. Charles Manson was born on November 12, 1934. He is now 82 years old. He was born in Cincinnati, Ohio. His birth name is Charles Miles Maddox. Charles Manson's mother was Kathleen Maddox. She was a 16-year-old girl who was both an alcoholic and prostitute. Kathleen later married William Manson. The marriage did not last. Charles was placed in an all-boys school. Manson's mother did not want anything to do with him. Soon enough, Charles was living on the streets and getting by through petty crime. By 1951, Charles began to spend time in prison. The first 32 years of his life were eventually spent behind bars. Manson was married twice. A new chapter in his life began when he met his first wife, 17-year-old Rosalie Jean Willis, in 1955. He then moved with her to California. Rosalie became pregnant, but Charles continued a life of crime, again stealing cars. Didn't take long before he was back behind bars. By 1956, Manson's wife had left with their child and her new lover. Later, Manson had another child with a different woman while being out on probation. The following year, he would spearhead a murderous campaign that would make him one of the most infamous figures in criminal history. Manson reflects in many ways personality traits and obsessions that are associated with gurus of cult quasi religious groups that soon began to emerge in the 1960s and are still with us today. He was pathologically deluded into believing that he was the omen of doom regarding the planet's future. In the same way that cult and evangelist figures today claim the prophetic knowledge of the world's end. Charles was not only influenced by drugs such as LSD, but by music of the time such as the Beatles song Helter Skelter and by artworks. In 1967, Manson gathered a group of followers who shared his passion for unconventional lifestyle and habitual use of hallucinogenic drugs such as LSD and magic mushrooms. The family, as they became known, moved to San Francisco and later to a deserted ranch in San Fernando Valley. At the time, his followers, which were numbering around 100, also included a small hardcore unit of impressionable young girls. They began to believe without question Manson's claim that he was Jesus and his prophecies of race war. In 1969, the county sheriff had them in custody, not realizing that he had murder suspects on his hands. But it was the confessions of Susan Atkins while held in the detention of suspicion of murdering Gary Hinman during an unrelated incident that led detectives to realize that Manson and his followers were involved in the Tate L.A. Bianca killings. Manson and his family were arrested not on suspicion of murders, but simply on the belief that they had vandalized a portion of the Death Valley National Park while they were hiding out in the Mojave Desert. On January 25, 1971, Manson was convicted of first-degree murder for directing the deaths of Tate L.A. Bianca victims. He was sentenced to death but was automatically commuted to life in prison after California Supreme Court invalidated all death sentences prior to 1972. Manson is serving his time in Corcoran State Prison in California. Even behind bars, he has still managed to attract followers. In January 2017, it was reported that Manson had been hospitalized in Bakersfield with a serious illness. There were no details about his medical condition or the inmate's location were disclosed, citing privacy and security reasons. Well, that concludes the video, guys. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy it. And if you did, remember to smack that like button. Let us know in the comment section below what you'd like to see next. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do subscribe to keep up with the world's best videos.